Good evening and welcome to TR Physics and today I'm going to talk about the effects that you can do with a photoelectric effect. Um, now, uh, a point that I'd like to make is about the first one I make is about the intensity of light, how bright a light is. The brighter the light, the more photons you have. This means, so intensity, greater intensity increases the photons. So if I have a really bright light, I have more photons being emitted than a really dim light. However, one photon interacts with one electron. So this means that a more intense light would not change anything to do with the speed they leave at, but it will change how many electrons are liberated. So let's say my photon is 10 joules. My work function is 3 joules. This means the kinetic energy I would have, so 10, 3, would be 7 joules. If I had more photons, this means more electrons would be liberated, but they would all have the same amount of energy than one of them. So they all have 7 joules of kinetic energy. It would just change how many are being liberated. However, what happens if I change my light? So if I change the light colour. So if I increase my wavelength, so I'm making it more red, the energy that I have would decrease. This means that, we go back to my situation here, my work function is still 3 joules, but instead of 10 joules, my light is only going to emit 6 joules, because it has a bigger wavelength. This means that the energy I have left for kinetic is now only 3 joules. So it doesn't affect how many electrons are liberated, it, that one affects its speed. So intensity affects how many, and wavelength affects the speed. And that's a really important thing to remember when we have state and explain questions that ask you, what happens if I use a brighter light? What happens if I use a different colour light? So this information will help you with those types of questions.